support in the event, uh, the, the logistical support you've provided. Uh, David, where's Dave? David's well, not here. He's not marathoning, but, uh, you know, David came out to check the roads for us. Uh, he's the front man with Ray Farns when there was a question about the availability of the, uh, of the land for the event. And uh, also uh, Claude Haynes, uh, I don't know if he's around yet, but... Uh, right here. Right here. Oh, there, hey, Claude, how you doing? Uh, Mr. Haynes uh, kindly is volunteering again to set up, uh, to set up the uh, snack, midnight snack table. Uh, where are you going to set that up? Uh, it's over there. We need to put the light on. Uh, well, so this is an announcement. We're starting a training session for people at the Kilmer Rotary Observatory. We've got a There's training next Friday night, and it's going to run from there. If you're interested in volunteering and kind of working in the public at the uh, 16 inch uh, scope, let us know. You can email Martin at observatorymanager.dbac online, and we'd be glad to have you. So if you're interested in volunteering, Thanks, Claude. So again, when you start about midnight or so, when uh, you start getting a little chill, uh, you've got coffee, uh, cocoa, tea, some uh, light snacks and everything for you. Um, they they offer it to us free, but it's nice if you put a little in the in, in the cup for them because uh, somebody had to pay for that and uh, and all. And it's a nice token of appreciation. So uh, avail yourself of it and, uh, and and enjoy. And again, thank you, Claude, for uh, for your work for that. We appreciate it. Uh, now moving on um, from uh, we uh, any anybody else from Arizona not in SAC or EVAC we probably have our Tucson contingent right. uh, Tucson everyone no oh. like that right. oh, right. right. surprise okay the Peoria close enough all right <laughs> where else we have uh, where where else from Arizona in Scottsdale all right and, and Anybody else? No, we, we do have, uh, where's your friends? Your Noel, they, they have Sierra Vista. He's from Sierra Vista, so we got somebody down that away. All right, now let's start moving out of state. I know we have a few today. Where are you from, sir? Oh, me? Yeah, you're out of state? Yeah, uh, Minnesota Astronomical Society. Uh, I'm the custodian of the Onan Observatory up there. We have several uh, large telescopes and several facilities uh, if you're ever in the area, um, Minnesota MNAstro.org, and uh, you're welcome to join us at those um, on public nights or even star parties. Okay. Where about in Minnesota the big state? Is it a Twin Cities area? or? Yeah. This is a, I'm from uh, the western suburbs of Minneapolis, and most of our equipment rings in the Twin Cities area you know, on good sites. So you must be enjoying getting away from the snow and everything now, huh? <laughs> yeah, we're having our... Uh, Marathon tonight as well up there, but uh, I already know it's a snow out or a washout. I forget which. <laughs> <laughs> well, welcome and I uh, hope you enjoy yourself today. Uh, Thank you for your hospitality. Okay, well, anytime. Colfax area, right? Eh? Uh, Auburn. Auburn. Auburn yeah, right here. Yep. Yep. And how are you going to do the marathon? What? Here? Yeah. Oh, just using my head. My memory. Oh. My memory. You did it last year. You got all 110 of them, along with Don Mockel. See, tonight, since 110 is not really the optimum number to, to get, not, you know, for Don, that's, you know, why bother? Yeah. <laughs> but uh, we've had Don, Don Mockel, who is one of the pioneers of doing the marathon here for the last three years. He's uh, doing one up in the area there. Yeah, I'm sure he'll be sitting there doing, doing one up there from memory as well. I uh, know we had somebody from uh, from Seattle, and there he is. Right, welcome, you enjoying yourself so far? Okay, great. Hope you have a great night. And uh, and then we're, I know so far. Um, California. California. Where in California? Truckee. Lake yeah. Tahoe. Tahoe area. Okay, you're, so, so far we well you're still furthest right now. And uh, who else? We've got uh, somebody's pointing there. Somebody from New York there. You're from Kansas anymore. You're from Okay, so we've got the IRS. Don't let her fool you. Okay, I know we have somebody here from New York. Where? There he is. And last year, this gent here took the uh, furthest traveled. And so far, I think he's still got that uh, or two years in a row. And now we'll move uh, to anybody else from out of state. That looks like it. Now I know we've got. Oh, we got one of them. Walking in with the hat. Walking, walking in and the hat. Okay. 
Where are y'all from? From with the hat. We're out of state. We're for out of staters. That's <laughs> you. Where are you from? Colorado. Colorado. Hey, if that's the first time we got Colorado on the map. Going back here. Somebody else over here. Okay. Uh, Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada. Oh, we're oh, out of state, out of country. All right. Which that segues to our other international visitor. Where are you, Sa Salvador? Salvador. Uh, Salvador comes to us uh, fourth year in a row from Hermosillo, Mexico. Yeah. All right, anybody else uh, not from the, the local area? We've covered the roll call, I think. So uh, with that, welcome to everybody. We hope you have a good time. Uh, and if you're going to run the marathon, I'm going to turn it over to AJ to go over the basic concept of marathoning and the general ground rules. AJ. Okay. You know, those of you who have at least done one or two know the ground rules. Okay. Those of you who uh, are here for the first or second time, the, the ground rules are uh, turn in this checklist. Okay. We'll uh, uh, I'll take a look at it and we'll see who gets first, second, and third place, and then everybody else gets a certificate for 50 or more. Uh, last year, uh, I, I wasn't able to do the marathon, and Rick did the marathon. He also had handled uh, uh, the uh, certificates, and I thought he did such a good job that he's going to find out right now that he's going to do the certificates for this year. Thanks for volunteering, Rick Kyle. After 17 years of the same certificate, your applause tells me something. You will be a like man, okay? Uh, the whole idea is this is an observing event. You look with your eye through the main eyepiece of the telescope, if you want to take pictures, that's fine. If you take pictures of all 110, uh, write an article about it and turn it into the marathon uh, 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 website, uh, Messier Marathon website. Uh, that's not enough to get uh, uh, an award, but if